Now, millions of children worldwide have grown up with Spike Milligan's story of Tim and Rose and their madcap adventure through the Great Black Forest and into Bad Jelly's Castle. Actually, it's particularly fondness here in New Zealand for it, actually. All in search of their beloved cow, Lucy. Lucy! Oh, so, so iconic. In New Zealand, it regularly <laughs> featured on morning radio with the album selling more than 40,000 copies and achieving double platinum stat status. I actually helped with that. Bought one. Tim Bray Productions is once again showcasing this classic children's production and we are joined by some of the cast to tell us all about it. Welcome guys, it's lovely to have you oh, here. Agony. Thank you. <laughs> so <laughs> good. I'm hey. really the star. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I've, yeah. I've, already had, I've got a backstory with this one here which is creeping me out slightly so we'll go into that another time. <laughs> How familiar were you guys with the story of Bad Jelly the Witch before you started? Uh, I knew it quite well. I mean my mum absolutely loved it, grew up listening to it in the mornings on yeah. Sunday and so I remember her reading it to me and taking me to a production um, when I was about five, six, seven, yeah. something like that. I remember seeing it in, um, in Palmerston North at the Regent Theatre and so yeah, I really liked it. Well that's how our parents got to sleep in. They'd put that on the radio they for did, us. They did, didn't they? Yeah. 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 Sleep in, whatever they were doing on Sunday mornings. I don't think I want to know. But <laughs> yeah, that, that was, it was an iconic part of our history, wasn't it? It was, and Jess, mm. I guess the same for you. You probably didn't grow up listening to it on the radio on a Sunday morning. Oh, I, don't, I didn't actually know the story at all. Right. Yeah, my, okay. mum's, can, my mum's Canadian, so I think it's, I don't know, maybe... It's it was a real New Zealand thing, yeah. which is funny because yeah. it's Spike Milligan, which seems strange. It yeah. should have been. Mm. It well, should have been. When I told well. my friends yeah. about it, they're like, "Oh, you're doing bad jelly," and I'm like, "Wow, it is Playing really good." Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And how do you feel being part of this production? Yeah, it's great. I love yeah. the story now. Yeah, yeah. it's really funny. Donna, is it true that Spike actually wrote this for his children? Uh, yes, it is. I wasn't sure whether to speak for myself or like to my friend. Definitely my friend, and he read it to his children. And so, hang on a minute. Oh, oh, hang on. You got me fleas in there. Oh yeah. Oh, juicy. Oh, she might need a comb down now. Sorry. <laughs> so clearly you played Dingle Mouse. <laughs> Mouse. Hey, Dingle Mouse. Hello. Are you Give good? Give it a high five. There you go. Ah, kia ora. That's some pretty good teeth you got <laughs> yeah, going yeah. on there. Yeah, I love my teeth. Sometimes I forget to clean them, but the kids will let me know. Oh, you're yeah. driving to that <laughs> too. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and of course, Bad Jelly the Witch. <gasps> Thank you. And it's great to have you here, Bear Jelly the Witch. I think. I'm not sure. It's wonderful to be here. And if you like, I'll do black sausages later with children. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Don't you get scared of you? Mm. Well, only a little. Okay. And then they realise how stupid I am. <laughs> and then it's all fine and they just laugh. Yeah. And they realise all sorts of things. I mean, there's so many iconic lines in the show that I think everyone must love when you're, when you're playing it to kids that are seeing it for the first time and to, to their parents like us where they're the witch you know people the giant runs off to bare bottom land yes, yes. Um, is there a particular favorite that any of you have <sighs> i like when mud wiggle um uh, explains how he kicked lucy into the into the river he says, I kung fu her into the river. And just the way that Dylan, who plays Mud Wiggle in the show, he does it really well. Oh, yeah. nice. Yeah, it's one of my... And I, I guess, you know, through the ages, the story has lasted the test of time. Because, you know, this is not the first time Tim Bay Productions have done Bad Jelly the Witch. So what do you think it is that, that makes it so iconic? It, as you were saying, it's New Zealanders have grown up with this story that mm. they've grown up as children and now like i was talking to an engineer who was saying oh, i've got to take my kids to the show because mm. you know mm. he grew up with it and it's such wonderful memories for him that he wants his kids to have a bit like christmas in a way mm. <laughs> it's an arc it's christmas. Yeah. It's an we like anarchy down here yeah we like yeah. having the underdog and all that and the underdogs win through and yeah, yeah, it's sort of crazy. And do you have live music in this production? Yep. Yes. Oh wow, okay, and how does that work? So uh, I think are you saying yes, I yeah. Oh, I can't. Yeah. Can you give us an example? Ooh, yep. No. <laughs> if I can. <laughs> Fiddle diddle dee, I'm a little flea. I ran up daddy through the leg and bit him on the knee. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. <laughs> got You've got a good singing voice. Yeah, yeah. the best yeah. voice ever. Um, <laughs> also, as, as always at the Tim Bray Productions, <laughs> kids are encouraged to dress up in character. Yes. Or, when they come yeah. along. So, mm -hmm. are there any particular favourite characters that get dressed up as? Bad Jelly gets dressed up as a lot. A lot of Bad yeah, Jelly. Yeah. You Lucy the Cow as well. A few dull boots. Yeah. yeah. Never what a about the shark? Bum the cat. No. What about the shark? Oh. No, but the shark's no. really good. Cool. I haven't seen the shark. Well, the there's still time good. to see yeah. one. Yeah. Very, very good. funny. See, there's quite some adventures they have. They have really, some incredible yeah. adventures. Um, Donna, you were in just, what, a matter of weeks ago talking about a, a very different play yes. where you were playing a crazy nun, essentially. Yeah. yeah. 
Somewhat crazy. So what do you love about this? What do you love about performing for kids? Well, I cut my teeth on kids' shows. Because mm. uh, back in the day, I'm so old, that, that when we had theatre companies, we also used to do school shows. So you'd finish drama school and then head off and learn everything about acting through performing with kids, because there's no etiquette yeah. as far as a child's concerned. They'll, they'll wet the floor laughing, or they'll go, this is really boring. Yeah. yeah no, I was <laughs> going to so say that. I, I guess it's a really good test, isn't it? And Jess, I... Oh, sorry. <laughs> 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 Just, I guess that's something you notice with kids. If, it, if it's boring, they'll let you know. If it's no, funny, instantly. they'll let you know straight away. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Is that part of the challenge in doing a show like this? Challenge, and it also, I don't know, it brings the performance more as well. Oh, nice. Yeah, you, you get the boos and you get the cheers, and you know. So, what's yeah. the best heckle you've ever had? <laughs> mm. We all heckle. You did get told you were a black sausage. Yeah, that was well, yes. I mean, you're a black sausage from the audience <laughs> the other day. <laughs> I enjoy it. There's a, without spoiling too much, there's a little piece of slow mo that we use in the show, and a lot of kids really like call out, this is too slow. And there was one little girl who goes, it's too slow for me. It was really stressing her out. Because it's yeah. right at the point of, will yeah. I die? Will yes. I away? <laughs> Jelly <laughs> going for the kill. Oh, that is... Oh, hurry up, it's too slow for me. Get them killed or not. Oh, that sounds great. Hey, well, it's a, such a tremendous production. Yeah. And I'm glad yeah. that you're carrying on the tradition of Bad Jelly the Witch. Are you guys always just liven up the studio when you come in here. I'm sure that's reflective of your performances yeah, as well. So Thank thanks you. so much. Thank yeah. you. Yes. Come along, everyone. It's yeah. 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 yeah! Currently showing at the Pump House Theatre in Auckland, Sakapuna. You can check out the Tim Bray Productions website for ticket details. <laughs>